what's going on YouTube? It's Maddie with Fusaro Fitness, and I'm here with Brittany today, and we just want to quickly address a question that we get quite often on both the Facebook page and in the YouTube comments about how do you guys deal with your relationship when you're dieting or if you're tracking macros? How do you go out to eat and stay on track with everything? Does it cause any problems within the relationship? And honestly, you know, everyone is different, but between us, we both understand that we have goals, we push each other to hit our goals. We do go to the gym together, we both track macros, and when we go out to eat, we just make smarter choices. And that doesn't mean, you know, you have to go out and get a piece of dry chicken breast. You know, we'll go out, yeah. we'll enjoy ourselves, but we're conscious of the stuff that we're ordering. Yeah, we just make smart decisions. We're aware of what we're eating. We also know that if we're gonna go out to eat at some point during the day, we kinda try to be a little more cautious of what we eat throughout the day, but we don't not do things because of we're dieting. That's exactly the thing. If we know we're going to go out to dinner during the night, you know, you just cut back a little bit during the day. You know, if you usually eat an enormous breakfast that's high in fat or whatever, cut that down a little bit and save the macros for later in the day. And again, don't stress over it. Don't worry. If you want to, if you're not getting on stage, if you're not doing a photo shoot, if you have no reason to get your physique judged by anyone, you shouldn't be pushing it to the limits anyway and obsessing over it. So we keep it simple. Again, track macros, make smarter decisions, but don't be afraid to kind of let go and enjoy yourself. I mean, quick example, we went to Atlantic City a couple of weeks back with my brother and my sister-in-law, and we actually packed some, you know, snacks. Healthier snacks with us so that all through, through, throughout the whole weekend, we didn't have to yeah. rely on what was there. We didn't have to eat so bad the whole weekend, but... It's not that we didn't, we still went, had wings and everything and enjoyed ourselves, but we gave ourselves options. So throughout the day we weren't not only eating so much at once, but we also were saving money too. That's yeah, that's another big thing. We made sure the stuff that we brought with us was enough to kind of get us through the day. Just because you're going on vacation also does not mean that you have to binge. Be you can, but... <laughs> yeah, I mean, if you want to, you'll probably regret it. And if you do go out to eat and you eat a little bit more than normal, don't regret it. Don't start doing hours of cardio. It's a new day. Just move on and don't feel guilty about it. But you can make the smart decision. What we did, we packed, you know, like rice cakes, jerky, stuff like that to eat on the car ride, to eat in the hotel room. But we went out to Hooters and got wings. We went to a sports bar and got burgers Everything. or pizza whatever we had uh, one night I mean I had a little bit to drink and I had like seven slices of pizza and you know I woke up the next morning I didn't feel guilty about it we came home from vacation we went to the gym so it's really not, as simple as that guys if you're yeah. not you're like you're not going out to eat every day it's you don't really have to worry about it that much if it's not an everyday habit have fun enjoy yourself I said they moderation is key I say that all the time it's the most important thing it keeps you sane keeps your relationship healthy and that's it if the person you're with doesn't support what you're doing it might not be the right person but if you're obsessing over it and ruining your relationships and friendships maybe you should rethink your decisions yeah so that's it keep it simple have fun with it enjoy life eat <laughs> enjoy, enjoy life <laughs> anyway thank you guys for watching the video we appreciate it subscribe subscribe like, like the it video. if you liked it and thanks for the support as always. Until next time, we'll catch you in the next video. Bye. Tomorrow, everything that you care about needs to begin today or you may miss the opportunity and it may never happen. If you don't do it now, you clearly don't want it bad enough. You can sit there and wish for it to happen or you can get off your ass and make it happen.